Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to upgrade the grub that you are having right now, the 0.96 version to 1.96 version. 0.952, 1.961. 1 so, um, what is grub? It's just it's, it's it's just a bootloader where you can boot to any other distro or any other kernel any other operating system like Linux distros from grub it's just a bootloader you have it specifies it just adds your UUID number of uh, your partition maybe your root partition and uh, it connects to that particular OS operating system and it, it loads your operating system so we are going to install that and later on we are going to apply themes to that grub 2 uh, okay so uh, some uh, you know people make anyway so we'll just go ahead with the tutorial um, yes you just type this command sudo app hyphen get install grub pc over here on your terminal window and then press enter and here you'll get two confirmation messages press ok ok twice and then you restart your system okay now we'll just try to go fast okay and then when you uh, load up you start your system you'll find something like this on your screen uh, there will be like a blue, sc blue screen and then uh, and here you'll have uh, your Linux operating system uh, and uh, you'll have a re recovery mode and operating system and above that you'll have you'll, you'll find some line that will disappear once you upgrade your grub2 grub2 the line will be chain load into grub2 this is what you'll find chain load into grub2 okay when you reach that just try to press e press e and edit the configuration because when you try to upgrade uh, your grub from grub to your grub to grub2 on the Jan John T Jack lab uh, there is a bug which is, it's a known bug and this bug is not there in Carmicola. so anyways if when you upgrade your distro inshallah like later on you won't find any problem but right now we'll try to just manually fix it so when once you do that you'll find this you'll find uh, something like this root and you'll have your UUID your SDA1 that is the your uh, your first partition of your hard disk that that will that your system will boot to you'll you'll find that particular UUID number over here so we'll just change the root to UUID and then press enter okay and then you click B probably you have to click B you, you check the message over I don't remember exactly so you may maybe you have to click B and then you have to boot your okay here we have it I guess uh, do I see something over here no we don't have anything over here anyways so you have to click B and after that uh, that's it you're on with the system after you log on to your particular user log on to your operating system just uh, open your launch your terminal window again and just type this sudo update upgrade hyphen from hyphen grub hyphen legacy press enter and then that's it press enter yes install it and now that's it you have upgraded your previous grub to grub2 so, so if you find it, if, you, if you face any problem just uh, you know try to comment over there and if I'll try to just help and uh, now let's go to installing the themes now first just try to type this command like sudo app hyphen get install as usual I'll copy all this information to my description box check it out so just uh, type this sudo app hyphen get install grub2 hyphen splash images it will be around 10 MB I guess so after you install that now install that then follow the tutorial okay now we will be browsing that particular one folder okay you have a uh, okay visit user hyph uh, slash share slash images slash grub so I just like type the same command over here okay once you uh, take your terminal window to that particular folder grub folder inside images share user we'll just try to list the files over here and here I've got like a lot of themes installed that came with that particular uh, application grub2 hyphen splash images from the Ubuntu repo uh, okay so here we've got like this many TGAs this is the format that we are going to convert so here we've got the TGA 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 alright 
so now here there are like a lot of TGAs and I'll show you my boot so this is my boot menu this is what you see this is what I see when I uh, you know boot my system I've got like this many uh, operating systems anyways um, actually kernels so this is the one if you want this one you can you know ask me I'll try to give it to you I, I, I have it somewhere I don't know where I kept it I've, um, so just let me know if you want this particular splash image so and here by default we'll have like plasma lamp sparkler you can try any one or if you want to make one like what I have done I've got these many wallpapers you can you know check some Ubuntu wallpapers online and you can do it yourself for example I will choose this wallpaper okay try to recite this wallpaper to 640 into 480 pixels use your GIMP menu GIMP image editor open with GIMP image editor over here and then you resize uh, this particular image to 640 into 480 and save it in TGA format TGA format okay so once you do that just keep it handy just keep the image handy over here just move that file over to this folder user share image grub folder just move that particular dot tga file to this particular folder like what i have done you see this ubuntu dot tga this was, was never there i have moved it over here so that's that's with moving the file and now we'll try to edit a very important file and try to force the system to locate the theme okay so now we'll be uh, so I'm I'm gonna copy this line over here. You just copy this file. So we are going to edit a text file. Zero five hyphen uh, underscore Debian underscore theme. Sorry, wrong password. I never do wrong passwords. Are you trying to make fun of me? Damn! What's happening? Anyways, what's happening? Just uh, hold on. This is funny. I've done this match. I've never had this problem before. Okay, this is weird. This is oh, I'm sorry. Just um, by mistake, I changed the language. Anyways, now sorry. Excuse me for that. Okay, that was some type of error. Um, okay, so this is the file that I was talking about. 05 underscore db underscore theme from etc grub dot d so we're going to edit it and this is the line that we are going to edit you see this for i in boot blah 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 you have this file over here actually you'll have some other file other line over here so you replace it with this exactly this what i have over here so i'll copy i've copied it over here this okay actually you have this file this is the line that you have this is the line that you have over there in that particular file so we are going to add actually we are going to we are going to force it to locate to even scan user share images grub by default it will only scan boot grub user share images desktop base now we are even telling him to scan this particular folder and after that your image whatever you have like mine is like ubuntu over here so whatever you have over here like ubuntu dot td tg or png i've not tried pg png so I better I recommend you to stick to TGA only so after you do that save it save the file and sudo update grub you go over here press sorry uh, actually I'm really tired today so um, yeah just type sudo this command over here okay just type this command press enter and you must find something like this found found Debian background like ubuntu.tga so whatever you used, used it if you used any one of these like uh, that came with uh, that package that we installed before like Apollo or like plasma lamp you must have that over here or your custom one like what I did you must have it over here so we have installed the latest version of grub and we have installed the theme just restart and check over it and you will have you'll find something like this so just try to beautify your grub now it will look somewhat beautiful 
that's with the tutorial I think I've taken a lot of time and in this tutorial I've made some mistakes like uh, the one with the password and I was just trying to be funny actually I'm somewhat tired um, uh, I guess that's it assalamu alaikum try to subscribe if you want to check my future tutorials comment rate spread the word boy